ஹாய் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் குட் ஈவினிங் ஒன்ஸ் அகெயின் வெல்கம் பேக் டு மை சேனல் முகாம்பிகா நர்சிங் இன் தி ப்ரீவியஸ் வீடியோ வி டிஸ்கஸ் இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் கொஸ்டின்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் கார்டியோவாஸ்குலர் சிஸ்டம் இன் டுடேஸ் வீடியோ வி கேன் சி ப்ரீவியஸ் இயர் இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் கொஸ்டின்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் மைக்ரோ பயாலஜி ஒரு ஃபர்ஸ்ட் கொஸ்டின் ஜெம் தியரி வாஸ் ப்ரப்போஸ் பை ஆப்ஷன்ஸ் ஆப்ஷன் ஏ பாஸ்டர் ஆப்ஷன் பி லேண்ட்ஸ்டைன் ஆப்ஷன் சி லிஸ்டர் ஆப்ஷன் டி கோச் ஜெர்ம் தியரி வாஸ் ப்ரப்போஸ் பை லூயிஸ் பாஸ்டர் ஆப்ஷன் ஏ இஸ் தி கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் அந்த நெக்ஸ்ட் கொஸ்டின் இஸ் சைட் ஆஃப் ரெஸ்பிரேஷன் இன் பேக்டீரியா இஸ் ஆப்ஷன்ஸ் ஆப்ஷன் ஏ செல் மெம்பரைன் ஆப்ஷன் பி மைட்டோகோண்ட்ரியா ஆப்ஷன் சி கோல்கி அப்பாரட்டஸ் ஆப்ஷன் டி செல்வால் ரெஸ்பிரேஷன் டெக்ஸ் பிளேஸ் இன் பேக்டீரியா த்ரூ செல் மெம்பரைன் ஆப்ஷன் ஏ இஸ் தி கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் And the next question is, one of the following bacteria have capability to form spores is options, option A, Diplococcae, option B, Vibrio, option C, Neisseria, option D, Clostridium. Spore forming bacteria are Clostridium species. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question, which among the following is a gram-positive organism? Options. Option A. Clostridium botulism. Option B. Klebsella pneumonia. Option C. Pseudomonas aeruginosa. Option D. Azinectobacter bomani. Our question is, which one is gram-positive bacteria or gram-positive organism? First one is, we can see gram-positive bacteria as Staphylococcus, Streptococcus, Pneumococcus, Mycobacterium, Clostridium tetany, Bacillus anthracis and Lactobacillus. So in our option, Clostridium is there. So that will come correct answer. And we can see gram-negative bacteria, Nerseria gonorrhea, Nerseria meningitis, Pseudomonas, then Vibrio cholerae, Salmonella, E. coli, Shigella, Brucella or X. gram negative bacteria so our question answer will come option a clostridium botulism is gram positive organism or gram positive bacteria all this questions are from previous year question papers okay and the next question is which of the following pathogens causes gas gangrene options option a mycoplasma option b clostridium perfringens option c enterovirus option d vibrio cholerae gas gangrene is due to the presence of clostridium perfringens option b is the correct answer move on to the next question which is an example of gram negative organism as we already discussed in the previous question gram positive and gram negative bacteria our option staphylococcus aureus option b listeria monocytogens option c vibrio cholerae option d streptococcus pneumoniae so vibrio cholerae we discussed in gram negative organism that is the correct answer option c and the next question is greenish color of pus from ulcer is due to infection by options option a proteus option b staphylococcus option c clostridium option d pseudomonas question is greenish color pus from the ulcer is due to the infection by pseudomonas option d is the correct answer move on to the next question bacteria that grow between 25 and 40 degrees celsius are options option a capnophilic option b thermophilic option c psychrophilic option d mesophilic here we can see the bacterial growth bacteria grows between 20 degrees celsius to 50 degrees celsius is known as mesophilic bacteria and between 55 degree celsius to 80 degree celsius is thermophilic bacteria and below 20 degree celsius is psychrophilic bacteria our question is bacteria grows between 25 degree celsius to 45 degree celsius so it is coming under mesophilic bacteria option d is the correct answer and the next question best way of sterilizing disposable plastic syringes is options option a uv rays option b gamma rays option c autoclave option d hot air oven our question is disposable plastic syringes if it is using again it it could be sterilized by using gamma rays option b is the correct answer and the next question is gram positive cocci occurring in grape like clusters are options option a streptococci option b pneumococcus option c staphylococcus option d sersinae 
Our question is which gram positive bacteria is in in grape like clusters? It is Staphylococcus. Option C is the correct answer. And the next question is dark ground microscopy is used for the identification of options. Option A virus, option B spirochetes, option C fungi, option D blue green algae. Dark ground microscopy is used for the identification of spirochetes. Option B is the correct answer. And the next question is streptococci causing neonatal meningitis. Is. Options option A group A. Option B, Group B. Option C, Group C. Option D, Group D. Our question is, which group of streptococci cause neonatal meningitis? It is Group B, streptococci. Option B is the correct answer. And the next question is, antibiotic used in toxic shock syndrome is? Options, Option A, Vancomycin. Option B, Streptomycin. Option C, Cephalosporin. Option D, Clindamycin. And the correct answer is, it is clindamycin. Option D is the correct answer. And the next question is, methicillin resistance bacteria are? Options, option A, streptococci. Option B, hemophilus. Option C, pseudomonas. Option D, staphylococcus. Methicillin resistant bacteria are? Staphylococcus. Option D is the correct answer. And the next question is the organism causing urinary tract infection or UTI in sexually active women is options option A Staphylococcus auris option B Staphylococcus epidermidis option C Staphylococcus saprophyticus option D Streptococcus viridens and the correct answer is it is by Staphylococcus saprophyticus option C is the correct answer and the next question is Operation theatres are sterilized by options. Option A, formaldehyde gas. Option B, carbolic acid. Option C, ethylene oxide. Option D, chlorine gas. Operation theatres are sterilized by using formaldehyde gas. Option A is the correct answer. And the next question is, heart lung machines are best sterilized by options. Option A, Acridine dyes, option B, isopropyl alcohol, option C, ethylene oxide gas, option D, 100% alcohol. Heart, lung, machines are sterilized by ethylene oxide gas, option C is the correct answer. This ethylene oxide is used for the sterilization of disposable syringes, then endoscope, disposable catheters, then disposable transfusion set all are sterilized by using ethylene oxide. And the next question is, non-disposable syringes are sterilized by options. Option A, hot air oven. Option B, incineration. Option C, autoclave. Option D, steamer. Non-disposable syringes, then glass wires all sterilized by using hot air oven. This hot air oven also used for the sterilization of metal instruments. And the next question is which stain is used to identify acid fast bacilli? Options option A Leishmanians, option B Grams, option C Shield Nelson, option D none of this. The stain which is used to identify acid fast bacilli is Shield Nelson's stain. Option C is the correct answer. Shield Nelson staining is commonly used to identify mycobacterium tuberculosis and mycobacterium leprae. And the next question is immunoglobulin that is inactive at high temperature is options option A IgG, option B IgM, option C IgA, option D IgE. And the correct answer is it is option D IgE. IgE Immunoglobulins are active during the time of allergic reaction or anaphylaxis. This Ig immunoglobulin is inactive at high temperature. So here the correct answer is option D. Today we discussed previous year questions from microbiology. Surely these questions will be helpful for your exam preparation. If it is useful for your studies, please subscribe my channel and share my videos to your friend circle.